Hey, you thieving bastards. Fucking DJ Grandmaster Flake, dude. Back on the ones and twos. Skirp, skirp, beep. The fuck's up, dude? You motherfuckers, you filthy, infected sons of bitches, dude. I can say that because I know the shit that I'd be up to. And I'm a fucking saint compared to you motherfuckers. So, yeah. Okay. I can only imagine the fuck what you fucking sickos are up to, dude. Fucking facts. El Joe still likes a good peephole. Fucking facts. Okay. Dude, we're at the park. And this fucking kid punches another kid. And the kid starts crying. And I'm like on the phone. And I could barely hear her. And so I was like, hey, kid. You shut the fuck up, please. Fuck, dude. And like, don't, don't trip, dude. The fucking kid's mom didn't even speak English. She had no idea what I was saying. And the kid could tell. He didn't speak English either, but he could tell by the look on my face, dude. Okay? The fucking universal or whatever. Okay? Dude. I still want to fuck that little rocker troll with the mohawk on trolls too. Just so you know, dude. Totes my goats. Totes my goats. Dude. Okay, here we go. So coronavirus is fucked up enough, right? Just when you think it can't get any worse, dude. Now they're coming out with murder hornets. Fucking murder hornets, dude. Okay? Like... You've heard of them, right? They call them murder hornets because they fucking kill you, dude, with one sting. Okay, they're deadly. So murder hornets apparently have been neutralized by a new species of rape butterfly. All right. Huh? Did you say rape butterfly? Like, no, no. You said new species of rape butterfly. New species meaning like... There's other ones. Like, dude, hold on. First of all, put your shit down. Pause the fucking video. Go fucking Google rape butterfly, dude. Go do it. I'll wait. I'll fucking wait. Okay? Rape butterfly, dude. It's like the news, the genetically engineered. Okay? Like they've been around for a while. And what the fuck is the rape part about, dude? Is like the genetic engineers that made the murder hornet. We're like, what can we fuck with? Like, what's worse than murder? I know. How about rape? Fuck, that's a great idea. Fuck, make it so, Johnson. Like, who the fuck, like, you know what I mean? Scientifically coordinated release effort, dude, on a genetically engineered insect species called the rape butterfly, okay? Shannon Kroger, okay, from a bee expert, but the Washington State University Department of Entomology stated the theory is that the murder hornet will be devastated by the physical and emotional toll of being sexually assaulted by these new rape butterflies. And I guess so, dude. It's like, because like, as if getting raped isn't bad enough. If you get raped by a butterfly, think about that fucking humiliation and shame, dude. Like, what the fuck is that? Pieris... Rape, okay? P. Eris, Rape, Rape. Okay, go look it up, dude. By the way, they don't rape the fucking hornet. They rape the fucking young larvies, dude. Who the fuck does that? Who the fuck does that, dude? What the fuck is that shit, bro? Known in the U.S. as the common... Cabbage butterfly, dude. Fucking facts, dude. Go Google this shit. Like, you can't even fucking make this shit up, dude. I would, I, dude, I'll bet you, as a bug, you wouldn't even be able to look another bug in the eye, dude, if you got raped by a butterfly, right? And fucking rightfully so. Like, your bug manhood is over, dude, that you even fucking let that happen. Like, yeah, you let that happen, dude. It's your fault. You let a butterfly rape you. Probably in the ass. What the fuck is that, dude? Who the fuck does that shit, dude? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go rape some larvies. Like, there's a butterfly sitting around that fucking thinks that shit, dude. That's his deal. 
who the fuck does that, dude? Who the fuck genetically engineers that shit, dude? Okay? And what the fuck is that genetically engineered shit anyway? It's like, why are you making murder hornets and rape butterflies when you could be genetically engineering unicorns? Be like, there's money in that, dude. You know how much money somebody would pay for a fucking real unicorn, dude? Especially if you made like a fucking nice classy one at like a white horse and shit. Like, there's big time money in that shit, dude. But no. You're going to genetically engineer fucking fucked up shit. Dude, a unicorn is like 97% horse and like 3% horn at the most. At the most. It's actually like less than a percent probably. And like, so if it's 90 fucking 8% horse, the horse part's already done for you, dude. The horse part's already done. All you have to do is genetically engineer the little fucking horn. That's not even that bad. And what's the deal with the mammoth? Like you found the mammoth in Siberia with living tissue on it. They got it at the highest genetic research laboratory in Japan. And a fucking mammoth is like 97% elephant. You have the fucking elephant part down. What the fuck is taking so long? Like I don't understand, dude. But you're not making unicorns. Like, I would think people would pay money for that shit. I have a story about fucking unicorns, like Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus. When I was a kid, I went to the summer camp where we're like, they did like fun shit. And one time we went to the circus and the circus was coming to town. And that season, the big fucking thing uh, was a unicorn. And they had found a unicorn and they were taking it all around the world. And um, it was on the poster and on the thing and like they did have a unicorn they had the elephants doing their thing the clowns doing their thing the gymnasts doing their thing and then the oh it's time for the unicorn uh and they fucking turn out the lights blew all the horns made a big old parade and it was a parade there were several cars several things like the whole circus got in on it and sure enough dude out came a cart like a fancy fucking gilded wagon with a unicorn in the back But it was a goat, dude. They threw the fucking goat at you, dude. Because, you know, a unicorn could be like a goat or a fucking horse. You know you've seen them both. So this was like a white goat with curly fucking locks. And it had a fucking curly, spirally, boop, uh, fucking horn. And, And it was cool, dude. It was real. It was there. It was a fucking unicorn. But you genetically... Engineer scientists are fucking up, dude. Because you're making fucked up shit and not making fucking unicorns and mammoths and shit, dude. Who the fuck does that, dude? Huh? Who the fuck does that, dude? I want to talk about Chappie, dude. Somebody fucking posted a fucking picture of Chappie. And I was like, first of all, that was a fucking cool movie, dude. That was a cool movie. Like, how the fuck did people in South Africa be some become so fucking cool? Like, they got the fucking coolest hair. It's like weird shit you never fucking see. It's like, not 80s, but it's like 80s. It's like, what the fuck? I don't know. It's weird. It's cool. It's cool. They were fucking cool. And they took the Frankenstein story, except they added the dynamic of manipulating, controlling, and lying to the Frankenstein in order to get him to do... You're bidding, which is what they did with Chappie, right? Like, remember the dad that was like, oh, Chappie, Chappie, mommy's hurt. The bad man's hurting Chappie, mommy. He has all the money in there. Won't let mommy have it. You want mommy to be happy, right, Chappie? You got to go get the money for mommy, Chappie. Mommy's going to die unless she gets the money. But you want daddy to be happy, right, Chappie? Daddy wants gold teeth. Mommy's going to leave daddy if he doesn't get gold teeth, Chappie. He's a bad man, has all the gold. You got to go get the gold, Chappie. He's like, nobody thought of that with Frankenstein, dude. It was like genius. Like, you could have fucking had Frankenstein doing all kinds of fucked up shit. And nobody thought of that. He was just wandering around, dude. He found that fucking wino. Go watch a black and white Frankenstein, dude. And watch Chappie. And tell me, like, who fucking was more gangster with it, dude. Chappie's family or Frankenstein's? Like Frankenstein's, they just fucking let him run around like a fucking wild animal. He went into that wino squat 
You know, it's a cool scene. He teaches them how to smoke and shit. He's like, smoke. Rah. I don't know. But like, that's what you were doing, dude. Smoking instead of fucking robbing banks and shit. Who the fuck does that, dude? Like, you know what I mean? Boobies. Hey, dude, this really fucking hot chick reached out to me, dude. Apparently watching fucking videos on YouTube, dude. Boobies. And you know who you are. I'm really just a lover, dude. That's all I want. That's all I want in this world, dude. They can make fucking unicorns and shit and stop making killer hornets. Most importantly, stay fucking golden. Especially you, you fucking nectar Canadian vixen. Shower.